Welcome to the channel. So today's video, I'm going to be talking about some business ideas that I think anybody right now can start and make some extra money, you know, before the pandemic is over. Depending on how much you're able to push it, you can even push it to making as much as 10k a month with these business ideas. Now, I came about these business ideas basically looking at myself right now, what I would willingly pay somebody to do for me. And I also asked a series of business owners who are in the same industry as me. Almost all of them agreed that they willingly pay people to do this kind of thing. And then I also asked them how much would they pay to get this kind of services. And the average price I was hearing from everybody was anywhere from 35 to 50K. Some even went as high as 70, some 80, but the average was about 35 to 50K. So I know that these business ideas already have a market validation and there are people out there looking for these services and more importantly, there are people that are going to pay for it. So let's talk about what these business services are. Now, a lot of people sell stuff online and they are generating leads every single day. They are getting new leads, you know, email addresses or phone numbers of people. But what happens is that they get all this information and then they really don't know what to do with it or they just get it and then they're using it to only do email marketing. They have a lot of information of customers or prospects, but they're not really doing anything with it. And so this scenario brings about two business ideas in itself. First business idea is like I've mentioned, email marketing. So if you know how to do emails or specifically how to write, if you're good at writing business content, or you know sales content like marketing content for these businesses you could be their marketing guy that helps them write emails most people don't know what to write like they open a blank sheet and then their head just goes blank like they don't know what to put down but if you're good at with that kind of stuff you can help people think up ideas for their business and write stuff for them they already have the leads right they already have the email addresses all you have to do is be the person that writes for them and you can write for them as many times as you like you could be sending out emails one every day it could be one every two days or one every week you know depending on the frequency that you decide with the business owner but i assure you there are businesses looking for this and they willingly pay you so if a business is able to get up to 100 sales from just your services in a month there's really no reason why they won't pay you 30 to 50k to just write emails for them so that's the first business idea and it just comes from being able to send emails and you're not, you know, like you're not the person getting the emails for them and all that. They already have the emails. It's just your job to help them convert. So that's the first business idea. The second business idea, which ties into this scenario is calling. Now I said, these businesses are already good at getting, you know, phone numbers, email addresses of prospects, but then they don't call them, right? They don't follow up with them. Or most people, they just have in their lead funnel, they have a place for collecting numbers and they just collect it like a year goes by they've not done anything with the numbers the numbers just go and if you know anything about lead um, marketing you know that it's very good to call leads as they put in their details right as they're putting in their details they're getting a call that quick turnaround time is you know what gets most people to convert and most of the businesses are not doing it right they don't have anybody that is calling for them so if you have a good voice this one will favor the females more if you have a good voice and you're good at answering the phone you could get in touch with a bunch of these businesses and be their phone person so all they have to do is just link it up in such a way that whenever they get a new lead the number gets into your hands and then you simply follow up with them and sell one of their products over the phone right so you can either get paid by just answering calls for them or you get paid even as a commission for the number of deals that you're able to close for them on the phone or you're able to get paid from a combination of the two so you get paid like a base fee and then you also get paid a percentage commission for a number of deals that you're able to close this is easily a seven figure business if you get the right type of people on the phone you're able to close them and you know you just make a good load of money for yourself and you can even turn this into an agency whereby you get a bunch of other people working with you and then your job is just to get different contracts from different people and then you have people on the phone every day you know just answering calls for them this kind of thing also applies to people that do e-commerce you know most people they get orders and they really do not have a system they don't have a system their system is broken down they don't have a system for you know someone just puts in their their orders and they have someone that calls them immediately on the phone Every business could use something like this, all right? Even 
people, uh, people like Jumia and the rest, although Jumia is better because they send you like text notifications, but most places you order and like nobody gets in contact with you till like two hours or three hours later and stuff like that. But if you have somebody on the phone and once the order just comes in, someone is there to call them on the phone, it's going, really going to boost conversions and they're going to pay you for that kind of thing. So. Those are the first business models that um, you can go with just from that scenario. The second scenario, which is a bit similar to these ones I've talked about, is the businesses that do not have leads at all. Now, these ones are struggling to get leads and they really do not have a way of getting leads, right? They're struggling to get phone numbers and email addresses of prospects. And so, if you're good at Facebook ads or if you know a thing or two about Facebook ads, I actually have a training on lead generation you can check it out in the, in the description on my site there should be courses there but if you're good with lead generation already you can simply help these businesses to set up a lead generation system and you can offer facebook ads as an additional service but being able to help them set up that system that helps them get leads on autopilot is something that businesses are looking for right most businesses that don't have a way of getting leads every single day they're going to appreciate something like that. Even if they are getting a minimum of 10 leads per day, 10 targeted high quality leads per day, at the end of 30 days, that's about 300 leads. Every business is going to appreciate that, especially if it's a business that has to do with, you know, high ticket stuff like cars, houses. Getting 10 leads a day is something they are really going to love. So if you're that person that can help them build up a lead generation system so they can get more leads per day, they're really going to love you, right? So that is another business model that can make you some good money if you're serious with it. Now, the next business model I'm going to talk about is graphics, right? Graphic design. Graphic design is still in vogue. It's always going to be in vogue. There are businesses that really struggle with graphics and all you have to do is just look at their social media pages and you're going to notice that they struggle with graphic design. They really don't know how to do graphics. They don't know, you know, what, well, like they don't even know like what graphic design is all about you just notice it on their page and they are willing to let someone take off their that load from their back and the thing with graphic design is that you really don't have to be like an expert graphic designer using photoshop and all that you can do some pretty advanced damage with canva just using canva you can do a lot of stuff with canva and so if you're good with canva you can make some good side money for yourself just by you know designing these graphics for these small businesses you can sign up a deal with them you help them to design like 30 graphics in a month then you're getting paid anywhere from 30 to 50k just to design graphics for these businesses and then they maybe someone else sees the, the page and then they refer more customers to you so just like that again just like the cold calling thing or the, the calling thing or cold calling you can also build an agency out of that whereby you have a lot of people working under you and then they are just there all you have to do is just get the work for them and these people are churning out new graphic content for your clients so that's a very terrific uh, business idea right there that you can be leveraging on and then the next one i'm going to talk about is building one page websites now there's a lot of new tools these days especially on instagram places like instagram where you really don't have the option of using multiple links on Instagram, right? You just have one link in your bio. And so some people, very smart people have created some tools that you can use to have like a full blown website with just one link, right? One link and you have a full website with all your features, product descriptions and all that. It's a one page website where it has like everything that a normal website should contain. And so you can actually build a business by offering this website uh, this one page website design services you can become the one page website expert and all you do is help businesses to design amazing one page website designs you just take their business you take their services and you create a one page website out of everything that they have to offer so that the link in their bios becomes more um, targeted more optimized to get more customers and to convert more sales right now most of these services i've listed right now there is nobody out there that is like the go-to person for all this and so that is the last opportunity that i want to talk about which is becoming the go-to expert for any of these things i've talked about so whether it's email marketing for small businesses probably being that agency that writes email marketing for or that writes emails for small businesses or being that agency that does like cold calling for businesses or being the agency that does you know the graphic design for small businesses i think there's something like that 
or I, I know there's one for video but being the agency that does you know the graphic design thing for small businesses or being the agency that does the email marketing for small businesses being the agency that even does one page website designs for small businesses is a totally big industry on its own and it's really going to make a lot of money for you depending on how you leverage it but if you're not concerned with playing big at that level like becoming an agency you can just take any of these businesses and craft a six or seven figure business out of any of these ideas so those are just the ideas that i was able to brainstorm based on needs that things that i'll probably pay for if someone pitched them very well to me all you have to do is just refine your craft refine your message put it out there and people are going to buy from you that's it for this video if you enjoyed this video or you got an idea here that's going to help someone you know someone who's probably trying to do something like this or somebody who is even doing any of these things you can just let me know about their business in the comment section i'll probably shout them out in another video or if this video has given you any inspiration for a new business idea all you have to do is like the video to show me that you loved it subscribe to the channel and do turn on the notification bell because that's the only way that youtube is going to let you know when i post a new video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one